Hey, what's up guys? It's Rick here, and I got a quick question for anybody out there who knows a thing or two about paint and mixing paint. I'm uh, trying to come up with a color for this engine here, and it's going to look like a, a remanufactured type engine, so I'm going to go with a gray. But I figured with the colors that I have already on here, if I go with the light gray, it's just, I don't know, it's not going to look right in my opinion. So I kind of want to create something a little bit darker. And my question is, I mean, I know when I mix them together, obviously, the more, you know, black I add, the darker it's going to be, you know, stuff like that. But my question comes is that some of these grays are uh, flat, some of them are uh, like a satin, some of them are gloss. And then I also have, you know, flat black, satin black, gloss black. And I want to give the engine a mostly flat look because I want it to look like it's it's been in there for a little while. You know, but I wouldn't mind if it had a little bit of sheen, kind of like this flat aluminum here, or even the steel on top. So my question is, is how will mixing the paints affect the uh, overall um, shininess or dullness? You know, I can, I can always hit this with dull coat, you know, if I really have to, but um, I guess I'll get a little bit, of, I'll get a sample of each of these and maybe do a little bit of testing, but I hope you guys can see if you have uh, used these colors and you've mixed them before feel free to let me know but we got a dark ghost gray, dark gold gray uh, royal air force dark slate gray which is these are uh, a lighter type of gray this is more of a I don't know how to explain I guess I could show you guys see there you go so I'm not really sure what I'm after I really do like these but they're really light, so I want to darken those up. And then I also have this engine gray here, but is this the engine? Yeah, this engine gray, and this is like a it's a flat color, but it's I don't know, there's something wrong with it. I took a bit of it out. Maybe if I try remixing it and thinning it out. Oh, that's another thing I want to know is when I mix these together, what would you recommend? Because I'm just brush painting this, I'm not doing any kind of airbrush work or anything. So, what would you recommend as far as thinning it out? I know. I mean, I wasn't gonna. I was gonna add a little bit of thinner, probably, just to help it flow better. Um, I noticed that heating it up uh, helps quite a bit. But you can see here on this. I don't know how well it's gonna show up on the camera, but there's very slight brush marks. But it does look a whole lot better than what I started with. And I do need to go over it once more, but. And I don't think it, I think it's just because I didn't warm it up enough, but it looks good overall. And the intake and the exhaust actually came out really good. So there's that. So if you guys could help me out with that, I appreciate it. And I guess I'll wrap this video up with saying uh, thanks a lot. You guys take it easy, and lots more videos to come.